Hi guys, so I'm here with one of the two bikes that I brought back from my recent trip to the manufacturing partner and uh, I've just been putting on the final touches and I'm ready to take it for a spin. So for those of you who aren't familiar with Flip, this is the Flip 16. I thought I'd give you a bit of an overview and to start with, I'll show you the fold. So it's rotation of the handlebars like that. And then using the front clamp, drop the handlebars down. And then the forks next, so there's another clamp down here. Fold in the front wheel. And then there's a lever on the back here that releases the rear wheel. And you're good to go. So you can then roll it around or if you want a more compact fold, drop the seat chase down like that. And we're good to carry. So for the electrical system, we've got a motor in the back wheel here. We've got a torque sensor here, which detects how hard you're pedaling. We've also got integrated lights front and back. So the, the rear light is at the back of the battery here. And we've got a front light over here. We've got a backlit LCD display here for controlling things like assistance level, tells you your speed, how far you've got left on the battery. Uh, talking of battery, the battery and electronics are all integrated into the frame here. And it's pretty easy to take the battery out and just pop out the seat post. Battery comes out like that. So you can charge from the battery itself, or there's a hole on the other side of the frame for charging directly into the bike. So one of the recent upgrades to the bike is the display. And the display is much nicer than the old one. It's a backlit LCD display. It's got some really cool features. Uh, probably my favorite one is on the back here. We've got a USB port for charging your phone. We've also got um, a little motor inside the display so that when you're pressing, when you're on, you know, riding and you're pressing some of the buttons, you never miss a press. So it actually gives you a little buzz to, to confirm that you pressed. Um, and it's got some great ride, ride data as well. So you've got all the standard things like um, average speed, uh, total distance traveled, uh, but it's also got things that it's drawing from the torque sensor, things like power that the motor's delivering, um, range, so how far left you've got on the battery, uh, you've got the percentage level of, the, ba of the, the battery as well, how many calories you've burned, um, all these kind of things that yeah, I think are, are, are pretty, pretty nice to have. It's also got a really cool feature, it's got a little light sensor at the top which you can set with an auto mode to turn your lights on if the light level's too dark. So yeah, overall really cool little screen. So on the mechanical side, there's some really unique features about this bike as well. Uh, one of the things that gives you a really smooth ride when you're riding this bike is the custom suspension system here, which actually consists of rather than a single bump of elastomer, it's lots of little discs that are separated. Um, and yeah, it just gives a really, really smooth uh, ride without taking up too much space. So we spent quite a bit of time thinking about how we could design these hinges because um, it's often a part of folding bikes that wears out pretty quickly and uh, we wanted a really long lasting reliable frame so uh, these are a little bit different to what you usually find. They're actually multi-material hinges so we have um, steel here, here and even on the threaded insert here as well in an aluminium body. So that means that all the parts that are in contact or are subject to high forces are really resilient um, and uh, long lasting compared to the, to the rest of the material. So you still get a really lightweight hinge, but you get a long lasting one as well. These demo bikes, we've also got the final production paint finish, which is a really nice smart matte finish, uh, which we're really happy with and um, hoping you're going to like it too. So I hope you guys have enjoyed seeing the latest features on the bike and uh, hopefully be showing you more when we do some test rides as soon as we can.